In this lesson, I'm just going to show you a simple um, animation of text, moving it around, making it look like it's shaking or, or uh, rocking back and forth, really, is probably the most appropriate term. That's pretty easy to do. You kind of get the idea with these motion tweens that you can do a lot. Um, so let's just open a, a new doc, and we'll add some text. And we'll just say, oh, I should change it from gray to a more um, recognizable color. Rocking text. There we go. So the first thing we're going to do is convert it to a symbol. Modify, convert to symbol, change it to a movie clip. All right. Now, it doesn't need to be a very long clip because um, let's maybe make it 20. So we'll insert a keyframe here. And now, around 5, I'm going to right click, free transform, wait until it curves like that, and I'm going to go. Well, actually, let me insert a keyframe before I do this. At 5, at 10, and at 15. Now at 5, I'm going to turn it like that. And then at 10, I going to leave it like that and then at 15 I'm going to rock it the other way like that and then at 20 we'll leave it like that now let's add motion between all of these like so. Now let's see if that's the desired effect that we want. We'll roll over it. Looks pretty good. Let's hit return or control test movie. And there we go. Rocking text. Look at that. Pretty easy, huh? So we can exit out of there. And just for kicks, let's make this clip longer. And so we'll insert a keyframe over to 50. Um, and I'm going to now, after it rocks back and forth, make it look like it's going to go up to the corner up here, down, around, 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 and back. So, I definitely want it back there. So first, from here, at 25, I'm going to insert a keyframe. And I'm going to move it. Oops grab the selection tool move it up here and then mm, at 30 I'll insert another keyframe I'll move it over here and then at around 35 or 36 have another keyframe move it down here and then around 40, another keyframe, move it over here. And then 45, another keyframe, somewhere around there. Move it up here. And then have it very quickly. <laughs> so another keyframe here. 
I'll have it very quickly go back to here and then finally back to there now all we have to do is insert our motion tweens in between like so and you might have to adjust the or we could have made these all even if we'd taken the time but it'll still it'll still look pretty good so and then here all right so now let's start from the beginning and let's take a look at it <laughs> let's test it out and movie form. And it went very quickly around this last section because remember we made the frames very close together. But there is an example of putting something on a path and rocking it back and forth. Like I said you can do it with objects or what, whatever. In this case we just did it with text. So save exit out of that and there you go. Do some experimenting.